Now at 6 o'clock, a South Florida rapper on the stand going on the record about being targeted for a crime. And 7's Rush Lowe is live for us at the courthouse in Miami with what he had to say there, Rush. Okay, this trial is all about a robbery and a rapper at the center of it all. This rapper, the victim in this case, sitting one moment getting a haircut. The next, he's on the ground at gunpoint being pistol whipped. And now, one of the accused stands trial. His name is British Mitchell. He's better known by his stage name, Briscoe. It was October 2009. In this surveillance video, you can see Briscoe getting a haircut at a Miami barber shop. That's when cops say four guys storm the place. They're accused of robbing Briscoe and pistol whipping the rapper. One of them guys hit, hit me with a gun. Where did he hit you? And like on the side of my head. One of the suspects, Kathleen Palmer, now on trial, and Briscoe takes the stand. Out of these pictures right here, he looks like the guy. The defense arguing there is no way Briscoe can make an identification. You kept your face right on the ground because you didn't want to take a chance at one of my, 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 we, we, They ordered us to get face down. Okay. I was down to the side. I had my, I had my head to the side. Most of the time. Briscoe is a successful rapper. He's recorded records with rappers like Lil Wayne and Rick Ross. Briscoe himself is facing an assault charge in another case, and he's painted by the defense as someone who sometimes doesn't tell the truth. Did the police ask you about whether or not you had a gun? Yes. Okay. And did you lie to them or tell, you the tr tell them the truth when you answered? At first, I lied. In court, the surveillance video is played. Briscoe had thousands of dollars worth of jewelry ripped off. The trial expected to last several days. Okay, so this case will come down to whether the jury will agree with Briscoe on this case and his identification or whether they will side with the defense saying it was impossible for the rapper to make a proper ID. We expect this, as I mentioned, to last several days. We're live outside the Metro Justice Building tonight. Rosh Lowe, 7 News.